how to enable dictation feature in your Mac. If you're using MacBook Air, MacBook Pro or iMac, the process is going to be same. Now, if you don't know what is dictation in Mac, then let me tell you that you can do voice typing with the help of this feature. So whatever you speak, it will be converted into text automatically. So it's a cool feature, but to use it, first of all, you need to go in system settings, which you can find in doc or else go and select Apple logo and then select system settings. Once you open settings page, go down on the left hand side and look for keyboard option, select that and on the right hand side, go down and look for dictation option. The very first option is uh, to enable dictation. So basically you need to turn on this toggle. So tap on that and select enable option to enable dictation feature. Now directly you can start using it. But before that, there are a few more settings you can take a look at. First is you can choose languages which you want. So you can tap on edit option over here and you can choose language whichever you want. I have already selected English, so I'm not going to change it. In microphone source, you can choose the source of microphone. So if you have connected external mic, you can choose that from here. Next is shortcut. You can assign a shortcut button to enable dictation right away. So either you can choose mic button or you can choose control key, command key or whichever key you want, you can choose from here. And last is auto punctuation. For now, I'm going to turn it off and I'm going to show it later that what auto punctuation do. Now everything is done. Let's start uh, using dictation feature. So to give a demo, I'm going to open notes application for now. And I'm going to say a few things and whatever I speak, it will be converted to text over here. As I said, you can choose the shortcut key to enable dictation. I'm going to press F5 because F5 has that mic icon. So whenever I choose F5, automatically uh, mic icon will be visible over here. And after that, whatever I speak, it will be converted to text. So let's start. Mac OS Sequoia brings effortless window tiling, comma, web browsing with fewer distractions, comma, new iPhone mirroring and support for Apple intelligence. Full stop. And again, you can press that shortcut key to turn off dictation feature. Now, instead of Sequoia, it has catched Khoya over here. So yeah, you need to check once a while that uh, it is converting the text properly or not. But most of the time you can see uh, it is working fine. So let's check out the auto punctuation feature. But if auto punctuation feature is off, you need to see the punctuation mark which you want to give. So when I said comma, it added comma over there when I said full stop it added full stop over there. So this is the only change and in auto punctuation it will automatically add the punctuation which is needed. So if I turn on this for now and if I go back to notes again I'll press five, uh, F5 and then start speaking. Mac OS Sequoia brings effortless window tiling, web browsing with fewer distractions, new iPhone mirroring and support for Apple intelligence. So over here, after window tiling, it has not added punctuation mark. So yeah, again, there might be some, uh, you know, hit and miss here and there. You can check or you can confirm, but this time instead of Sequoia, it has written Sukova or something. So yeah, you need to correct that, but rest, uh, all the things are fine, I guess. So if you find this feature interesting, you can start using it. Now you know how to enable dictation in your Mac. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, then don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.